All right, I'm gonna come in one at a time just so you can see what these are. So this is the Spaced Rift Escalation Pack. All right, so we've got um, some extra dice. Um, let me rip this open so you can see what exactly is inside the Space Rift Pack. So just a simple bag here. And we'll try to get this so we don't damage anything coming out. All right. So let's get the dice out. And what are we doing with these? Come on. All right. So, okay. And easy to punch. They're falling out as I move them. No idea. Okay, and some rules, a rift in space. So although very unusual, can assist the wise commander in taking advantage of its unique properties with all features in space, there is also the possibility of danger. In the case of space rift, units on a rift must watch out when the folds in space occur. Let's take a peek. All right, very nice. All right, Meteor Storm Escalation Pack. So again, we've got a couple more red die, or dice in this case, and they're already popping out, but it looks like those are meteors that are flying through. Let me pop these staples and we'll get a look and I'll read over the brief on the pack here. All right, let's slide that out and there they all come. So come here, come here, come here. Look at that. They're all coming out loose. I like it. High quality. All right, so shower one, shower two. I don't know what these are, but look at that. Simply popping out. Okay, not as easy that time. <laughs> Let's see what a meteor shower does. Meteors to most commanders are a mere bother and nothing really to be mindful of. That is until a shower or even worse, a storm smacks into a number of ships that were not paying attention. Easy to avoid until you are also under attack. Enjoy Richard Borg the Borg system. So let's see, we know we've got our big circles here. Okay, not sure exactly how they factor in, but you've got more scenarios. Scenario 20, planet pull us under siege. Nice. All right, we have the Quartermaster's Escalation Pack. So again, I'll try to read this now rather than after I rip it out, but we'll see. Welcome to the Quartermaster's Escalation Pack. The Quartermaster, the fleet's expert in supply and logistics, provides Red Alert players with 48 additional markers for the Commonwealth and Confederation factions. These unit markers allow you to expand and customize the variety and number of support vessels you may take into battle. Very interesting, very interesting. So we're going to have all these tokens. Let me... Uh, let me get this out of here so we can take a little bit better look. All right, coming in. Let's see here. So, let's see what we got. So, I wasn't sure if we had one or two. So there's your tokens. Elite fighters, cruisers, carriers, and how many pages here? Scenario 24, scenario 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. I can count. Commonwealth counter offensive. All right, so what you're going to see is me breaking out some of these boxes with different ships in them. One thing from being a Kickstarter is you're going to get a lot of the bling up front right out of the chute. So some of you that know with, well, let me get this out of the shrink and then we'll chat some more if I can get her open. There we go. So Command and Colors Ancients, for example, you can see what we've got here. 
you have five, is it five different expansions that came out, which is great. But sometimes, you know, you're, you know, if you got in early, then you're waiting or maybe something's out of print. And there we go. That's everything. Let's get that out of the way. So let's see. Let's get these out so you can see them a little better. Here is, and again, I may take some standalone pictures just because we can get better detail that way. All right. Your stands, other stands, and little fighters. Let's see what we got here with the Vice Admiral flagship. As the old saying goes, two heads are better than one. This also applies when a task force has two command vessels, an admiral's flagship, and a vice admiral's flagship. Enjoy. All right, so rules for that. Some other scenarios and some tokens. All right, we've got the carrier starship escalation pack. So we're going to have more of the carrier goodness in here. And again, you'll see we've got a rules pack. And then I'm going to pull this whole thing out so that we can just see the ships. So we've got the counters, the ships, and the rules pack. I'll show you the ships again, although you've probably seen some of them already. But carrier unit is by far the most interesting unit in the Red Alert game. This is from Richard Borg. So we've got some scenarios. You've got your counters. And then we will pull these out. Just the ships. The rest will be the stands. But you can see the carriers. And again, I may throw in photos. All right, we're going to keep moving through. We've got the Dreadnought Starship Escalation Pack. All right, again, see if we can get everything to just slide. So here's our Dreadnought unit. We'll get to the plastic in a second. The largest and most feared ship in any fleet is their Dreadnought. What more can be said about this unit? The Dreadnought is the ultimate kick-ass ship and red alert. Enjoy. All right, let's see. Wow, looks cool. Scenario 10. We've got our stands. We've got our counters. Let's take a look at the ship. And we'll leave the stands in there. I will say the ships look blockier, and this is for all of them. They're more blocky rather than sleek. Um, so I don't know. I'll have to see on the design-wise. But there you go. And the final and the heavier of the ex escalation packs is the logistics and space platform. Now, I should have flipped the other ones over because then you get a quick idea of what is inside. So it looks like some uh, base stations. Space platform, transport ships, one rule book containing special rules, and a, four new scenarios. All right, let's get all this goodness out. Empty. So first, so space platform units. A space platform is not only a strong defensive unit, its ability to strike at long distances makes it a weapon to be reckoned with when deployed. All right. Uh, scenario 18, what else we got? Scenario 16, 17, 15, and then your rules, different counters, and big old bag of stuff. Let's get them out. All right, stands. Here is some space platforms. Let's see what this is. Okay, interesting look. And they're different, which is, uh-oh, what is that? Okay, we'll have to figure out what that is. So, very cool. Nice different look. And then, let's see what we got here. Okay. And these look to all be the same. So, interesting. All right. 
Now, we'll see how everything plays. Mm -hmm. 